everybody for coming out. Uh, as Eugene mentioned, I did a little piece with Al Jazeera English um, the weekend that this museum officially opened. I feel like, you know, I there isn't much more to say other than it was pure propaganda or propaganda, really. They, they really tried to paint this, like, friendly face of, like, yeah, sure, we started as slave catchers, but, like, look how far we've come. Like, it really, I mean, the video that they show you when you first arrive is unbelievable. But, you know, I mean, they're ruining disco songs, like, cops dancing in the cars, like, being, like, hey, right, we're, like, we're your friends. We're not, like, there are just a couple of bad apples out there, like, killing you guys, but it's not all of us. Um, so yeah, it, it's terrible. This fucking thing costs like twenty-five dollars when I to come in here. <laughs> and like Right, so yeah, all I can say is they completely erased Black Lives Matter from the entire conversation around Ferguson. Um they really you know, love to they have paid tribute to J. Edgar Hoover. Like just dedicated to him and like there's like a little tiny display hidden in a corner about the militarization of like the cops like that's just like an afterthought so yeah it's trash this museum's got to go yeah. Yeah. we need to like <laughs> all right yeah i'm telling you uh this museum has got to go it's propaganda it's trash yeah. yeah, all I can say. Yeah. Thank you, Natasha.